Hi, I'm Victoria with Clive Coffee, and today we're going to be showing you how to set up your Barazza Sette 270 espresso grinder. Step 1. Out of the box and onto the counter. Remove the grinder from its box and place it on a solid, level surface. Inspect the grinder for damage. If you notice any, contact us immediately. Insert the hopper, rotate it, and turn the key to the unlocked position. Plug the grinder in and turn it on. Step 2. Feeling the coffee. Put some beans in the hopper and grind them into your hand. Feel the grounds. For espresso, they should feel similar to table salt. Not as fine as powdered sugar and not as coarse as sand. If too fine, adjust coarser. Too coarse, adjust finer. The espresso setting is usually between 5 and 9 and varies based on coffee and atmospheric conditions. Step 3. Nailing the dose. Now that the grind is in the ballpark, it's time to start pulling shots. First, grab a scale and tear the weight of the portafilter. With the portafilter and the portafilter holder, press the 3 button, which has a default setting of 30 seconds. Then press the play, pause button to start grinding. Press it again to stop when the portafilter is nearly full. Now weigh the portafilter. Add or remove grounds as necessary to get to 18 grams. It's worth noting that the Sete 270 is a single dosing powerhouse and its conical burrs and vertical grind path make for almost no grind retention. If you're only making a couple cups a day, single dosing is ideal for keeping your coffee fresh. If you plan to single dose, simply weigh out your beans ahead of time and grind them through. If not, now would be the time to fill your hopper. Step four, adjustments and drop time. Now you can compress the coffee with your tamper. Remember, tamping pressure is less important than making sure your tamp is level. Insert your portafilter and start the shot. We're going to be watching for the time of the first drops of espresso to fall between 6 and 10 seconds. If they fall outside the window, you'll have to adjust the grind setting. Under 6 seconds will be thin and sour. Over 10 seconds will be bitter. Make small adjustments. This will be easier than making big changes and overcorrecting. Step 5. Total shot time. Grind a fresh, full dose. Tamp. And pull your shot. This time, we'll be looking at the full shot time and a target output of 1.5 ounces or 30 grams of espresso in 25 to 30 seconds. If it falls under 25 seconds, adjust your grind finer. If it falls over 30 seconds, adjust coarser. Step six, dosing by time. Once the grind is dialed, we can set up the grind timer for consistent and repeatable dosing. With the hopper filled, press the one button and use the arrow buttons to adjust the time to seven seconds. Place your portafilter in the holder Press play and wait until the grinder stops. Weigh the portafilter. If the dose is too small, increase timed setting. If it is too much, decrease it. Now you will be able to get a repeatable target dose, 1.5 ounces or 30 grams of espresso in 25 to 30 seconds. For more tips on brew ratios and coffee extraction, check out this article from the Clive Journal and watch our espresso essentials video here. For more coffee know-how, don't forget to check back in at clivecoffee.com.